Hey, how's it going? This is Bonnie Andrews right here from Live Gem Studios. God bless you. Thank you so much for praying for us. Thank you for partnering with us. Thank you for standing with us all through the last year. We've seen some great stuff happening in 2016. New people, new ideas, new locations, um, new office, uh, new partnerships. And today we are in 2017 right here in capital city of New Delhi. Dreaming big dreams because God is speaking to us because 2017 is going to be a year of supernatural harvest. God has been impressing on our heart from Genesis chapter 26 and verse 12. The context of the scripture is that Isaac is standing in the middle of a thick famine and there's famine all around and everybody else is leaving that particular city and wants to go to another city which is Egypt. But God speaks to him and says, Isaac, stay here. Maybe today you're going through a hard time and you probably want to quit and leave and do something else and leave your environment and things that are happening in your life because things are not happening the way that you wanted it. But God is speaking to you this, this morning. Literally stay there because God is wanting to do something amazing, special, supernatural in your life. And verse number 12 says, I succeeded in the time of famine and in the same year he reaped a hundredfold harvest. Wow, isn't that amazing? Hundredfold harvest. We're living in the world of startups and scale ups, and every uh, business guy out there is looking for a return on investment. This investment return in the time of famine is 100x. Wow, that is amazing. 100x. You know, what I understood about Gerard is that in a normal, optimum condition, Gerard had almost like a 25 to 50 times harvest in a normal, optimum condition. Today, the condition in Gerard right now is the is, is this thick famine in the land. There's absolutely no water. The, the soil is cracked, but Isaac still sows a seed and reaps a hundredfold harvest. Wow, it's amazing. It's, it's inspirational for us. This year at Live Jam, we are so excited about this word that we are believing for a hundred X harvest. Hundred times. The seed is powerful. You know, you can hold on to your seed as long as you want, but unless you sow it into the ground, it will never bring about a harvest. Today, I want to challenge you to sow a seed in the middle of the crisis that you're going through, in the middle of all that's happening around you. I want you to sow goodness. I want to sow love. I want to sow, sow uh, you know, uh, faithfulness into your family. I want to sow financial seeds in the middle of all the crisis that you're going through into the lives of people, into ministry, into God's kingdom. Now, I want, to, I want to tell you something. God is going to give you a supernatural harvest.